Good day, YouTube. Due to the very recent official release of Linux Mint 20, as you can see here on the left, I thought I'd do a bit of a quick follow-up video of two very popular Linux distributions here, Linux Mint 20 on the left and MX Linux, uh, currently 19.2 on the right. So a bit of a just a basic, simple view at the, uh, the hardware or the resource usage, see what's heavy, what's not. Now they both are running on their default desktop environments. One is actually on XFCE, so that's uh, the MX uh, Linux on the right and Cinnamon on the left. So let's have a bit of a look into it here now. And if we were to jump across to the, uh, the CPU usage, starting off nice and idling, as you'd expect really with any operating system there. These have been booted up from scratch, so there isn't anything in the background really running apart from the, the OS itself. Now, in terms of uh, RAM usage, this is where it gets pretty interesting, and you may expect this because we've got a bit of a lightweight desktop environment on the right, XFCE for MX Linux there. So it's uh, running at just under 500 megabytes of RAM out of the box uh, with nothing else loaded up. Now, they do both have the same uh, the RAM allocation, so two gig of RAM there just to see how we go. But we are actually running at about 150 megabytes of RAM more. So. On the left, as you can plainly see there, Linux Mint 20 is actually using about 650 megabytes of RAM. So a little bit more in nature, but um, perhaps maybe not too much more. Uh, XFCE is sometimes, or well, usually known to be a little bit more lightweight. So if you've got an old PC or laptop, might be a better recommendation to go with the MX uh, Linux, which is apparently the most popular Linux distribution there out there. I'm, I'm not quite convinced that that's uh, the case, but um, based on uh, certain websites, you might be told such a thing. But that is pretty much it now for guys, uh, for that guys. Uh, just having a bit of a look, very very basic, simple, really non-scientific uh, assessment of uh, what's going on with the, the RAM usage CPU out of the box. So thanks for watching, please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and uh, yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next one.